Hello, this is Artifacts of Mars. I have an unusual phenomenon on Google Earth to show you. We're going to take a look at some of the uh, rainforests and just plain old forests from around the world. I was actually, this is the Congo in Africa that we're looking at now. What I was looking for, I've heard that there are uh, maybe Dino's hiding out in the jungle and I was hoping to get lucky and catch an image. But what I found here is that the detail is extremely low. And I thought that curious. I remember, and I also found the same thing in Brazil. Now, remember one thing. These countries are not hostile to the United States. We have normal diplomatic relations. We deal with them all the time in UN and all that. So there's no problems between us. And yet, the Amazon rainforest is all blurred out. It's like it's pixelated. It's more typical of the Mars images. You have to remember, all of this is satellite data. We fly over there, our country all the time with satellites, and we get photographed and all that. There's no problems between us. So what is going on here? It's all blurred out. It's all pixelated, like uh, many of the Mars images are. Except this is Earth. And while we only have a few satellites around Mars... They got hundreds of them around the Earth, if not thousands, however many. You see, it's all pixelated. So, this is a Congo in Africa. There are areas that no modern person has ever been to. That's how remote we're talking. If you were to parachute down in there and survive the attempt, you could disappear forever and nobody would ever know where you are. And this is a primitive, primitive area. So why is everything blacked out? Well, I'm going to put this on hold, and then we're going to go to the Amazon and take a look at that. Okay, now we're in the Amazon, and we're seeing the same type of pattern. Although, strangely enough, there are some forests in this area where you have very good detail. I'm going to see if I can find that. Well, I'm wondering what's going on here because... You know, they have almost no detail again of the rainforest. Once again, we have normal diplomatic relations with Brazil. I'll see if I can find that patch of forest again that had the good detail. Okay, we're still in Brazil, but to the east of the rainforest. Now look at this. You see the difference in detail? It's startling. You have full detail here. You see individual trees and everything. And over there, there's almost nothing. It's like it's all pixelated out. Artifacts Mars would like to know why. But it gets worse from here, trust me. Well, uh, I'm going to show you how it gets worse. Country of Peru, same exact thing. Very low detail. And again, we have normal diplomatic relations with Peru. So it's not a political thing. I want to know why all this is black. Uh, pixelated it out. I'm not suggesting any conspiracy theory. I just want to know why. Uh, a lot of people think, well, you can't ask why because it's just the way it is. That's not good enough. Okay. So, what we're going to do, 
You gotta take a look at a few other places in this world. And we're going to take a look at the difference in the detail. We've seen the rainforest is pixelated out. And the Congo is pixelated out. The rainforest in the Congo. So we'll take a look at a couple other places. Hang on. Okay. I'm having a few computer issues. This is Guatemala. And here the rainforest is not blacked out. It's not pixelated out. Pretty good detail overall. Once again, standard diplomatic relations. There's a cloud that casts shadow. No surprises. And yet down south, in Brazil, the rainforest is uh, blacked out, and I want to know why. So we're going to take a look at home here, the United States. Just for reference, I don't live in this state, I live in New York, but here's the point. Good detail, right? You go over in the United States and find good detail. No surprise there. Now we're going to move over to Asia. Hang on. Now here we are in Russia, at least with them. We still have diplomatic relations, of course, but we're not doing so hot with them. They're all pissed off at us. We're all pissed off at them. And let's look at the resolution here. Lousy. This is Siberia, by the way. So the resolution here is really lousy. At least with them, I can say, well, our relations are lousy, are bad, so maybe they're hiding something from us. I don't know. Hang on. These images were made years ago. This is the thing. So we're going to move to China next. Okay, we're in China. Now this country is our enemy, and they're getting aggressively militaristic. So what do we have? Beautiful detail. These small stuff. I mean, this is a forest that looks like you just walk right to it. So politically, there's a problem, yeah, this looks just fine. Alright, I'll put this on hold, and we will head on over, check out a couple more places. Another great bastion of freedom, North Korea. And they're threatening to blow us up on at least once a week. Now let's look at the detail. Great detail. Beautiful detail. Not as good as some areas, but my god, you can see the buildings, you can see the trees. So now we're going to move to South Korea. I probably won't put it on hold. Again, great detail. This is South Korea that we're looking at. See the roads, see everything. Great detail. So no problem there. So I think the inquiring mind would like to know 
why this is that in some of these places we're seeing great detail and others we're not seeing any detail. Country Japan friendly, normal diplomatic relations. And everything looks good there. Yeah, fudge, I'm not that good at uh, geography, but at any rate, getting the point. Let's take a look at the island of Taiwan. Which the Chinese government would love to gobble up. Good detail. So we've had a mixture of friendly and unfriendly countries that I've looked at. And most of them, except from the Congo and Brazil, we have good detail on everything. Philippines. Stunning detail. In relation to the United States, friendly. I don't want to go too long on this video. But I'm hoping you're getting the point. Something is odd about some of these rainforests. And remember, this is all satellite data, so when we fly over them, there should be no difference, right? This is the country of Indonesia. Detail, lousy. Relations with the United States, generally friendly. We have normal diplomatic relations. So my question is, why are some of these rainforests and just old forests being blacked out or pixelated? Is this an intentional thing? Or do they... Or do they screw up one more country of Australia friendly good detail so the question remains I'm most curious about the rainforest in Brazil and the Congo why why, oh why, are these uh, all pixelated when most of the places that I've studied here have very good detail, you can even see individual trees, and yet Congo Forest and the Congo Jungle and the Amazon Rainforest got very lousy detail, it seems like it's all pixelated, a lot like some of the stuff on Mars is. At least with Mars, you can say, well, you know, that's a long ways away. We've got satellites there, so on and so forth. Fine. Inquiring minds wants, want to know. This is Artifacts of Mars. This is just what, not why. Maybe somebody out there has an answer for me. Thanks for watching.